Hello, welcome back to Mr. Cooley's class. I'm Mr. Cooley. Today we're going to be talking about symmetry. We're going to be talking about line symmetry and not rotational symmetry, so be sure to know that this is line symmetry. Our definition for symmetry is when an object is equal on both sides. sides. That's correct, both sides. That means if you could fold it in half, it would be equal on one side and equal on the other. For instance, right here we have a, a bus. Now this bud can only be folded down the middle because if you fold it any other direction, it's not going to be equal. Whereas the square polygon can be folded in at least one, two, three, four, four different shapes. The, the octagon can be folded in many shapes. The heart, when you break it in half, can only be folded down the middle. The circle can be done in so many ways, I mean, infinite amount of lines of symmetry. Let's take an example over here of a gingerbread man. Gingerbread man's been running as fast as he can, but we caught up with him and we're going to cut him right down the middle. He's having surgery right now. Almost right down the middle. Now, as you can see, you can fold him in half. He's going to be equal on both sides. The triangle, this geometric shape, which has three sides, can be cut three different ways as well. Right down the middle, see how if you could fold that, it would be equal on that side, on this side, and right down the middle on this side as well. There you have it. That's an example of symmetry, line symmetry. Thank you for coming to Mr. Cooley's class. Do your homework.